Hi, my name is Jay Henderson. I'm with JMA Wireless. Today we're going to take you through the installation process of the WPS-DF port seal. Please refer to your installation instructions for the compatible port dimensions. It's very important. We're going to be using our WPF-DF cutter. We're going to be using the jumper with the WPS already installed on it. First of all, you want to pull out the measuring slide. You want to install it onto the port and push it in until it stops. Remove it. Take the knob, turn it, and lock it down so it doesn't move. So take your DF and insert it into the WPS DF cutter. As you see on the side, there are two press points. Press in and take the blade and twist it around to cut the DF. So once you complete the cut, open the blade up, take the white slide, and push the DF out. Remove the DF. Take the grooved edge and make sure that that's facing the threads. Slide the DF on. Make sure it's at the top of the threads. Take your jumper. Install your jumper onto the port, whether it be an antenna, duplexer, diplexer, TMA, etc. Take your torque wrench. So once we've installed our jumper and we've torqued it down, we want to make sure that the ribs on the DF are, all, are covered by the boots. So take the boots, slide it up over, and make sure there are no ribs showing. Now your installation is complete. 